And the time is 5.25. Now, WISM Instant News. Brought to you by your Ford dealer who invites you to see his news station wagons with the exclusive two-way tailgate, one of the many new features by Ford of 1966. Good afternoon, everyone. Dwayne Daniels reporting. These are the top stories at the hour. President Johnson has given a Secretary of State, Dean Rusk, added authority over the overseas activities of American agents. The Justice Department has moved to have the W.E. Du Bois Club, a leftist youth organization, register as a communist front organization. The FBI has tracked down and arrested a man who, it says, had threatened to assassinate President Johnson. The big blizzard is still blowing over North and South Dakota in Minnesota and it has now moved into Nebraska, Iowa, and northern Wisconsin. The death toll has climbed to 60 in last night's tornado in Mississippi. And only nine persons are known to have survived the crash of a Canadian jetliner in Tokyo today, but 63 others died in the crash. A $10,000 fine and three years of probation were imposed on Dr. A.F. Otto today on his conviction of two counts of criminal abortion. Dr. Otto was also ordered to pay court costs, which could reach $8,000. 33-year-old Kyle Liebig, Latham principal, acquitted on a morals charge earlier this week, today resigned. The University of Wisconsin Board of Regents today voted to limit enrollment in the university system. Limitations on the Madison campus for out-of-state students will remain the same. The National Academy of Sciences today denied a report that they have cut to five the number of sites still in the running for the $357 million atom smasher. One of the sites mentioned was Stoughton. An executive of the Carnes Corporation today termed absolutely ridiculous new wage demands by the Sheet Metal Workers Union. And the company official said that the plant might as well shut down. During the big special board sale and you get them while they last. Now, WISM reports in depth. The Wisconsin Federation of Women's Clubs, which has been verbally sandbagging the state's 133 legislators to update our oleo margarine laws, sees some cracks in the butter wall. As most everyone knows, Wisconsin is the only state that prohibits the sale of colored oleomargarine. In addition, it levies a 15 cent per pound tax on the uncolored product. The Federation's legislative chairman, Mrs. R.V. Anderson of East Troy, points out that some dairy groups are, in her words, seeing the light. The Wismland forecast, snow, windy and colder tonight and tomorrow. Windy and colder with snow diminishing to flurries tomorrow night. Considerable blowing and drifting snow tomorrow and tomorrow night, clearing and cold on Sunday. The Wisdom Weather Summer, blowing snow. The news has been brought to you by your Ford dealer, the man with 49 for 66. Fords, Fairlanes, Falcons, Thunderbirds, and Mustangs drive one right away. Yeah, this is the place here at, uh, you're not out of bed yet. All right, 5.32, let's add about 40 seconds to it and uh, say this is WISM 1480 on everyone's radio dial. The Sound of Music Survey from Madison, Wisconsin. You, Bob Lynn, you, I like your record, I really do. Sixth last week, same way this week. The Elusive Butterfly, the final portion of the Joe January show. You might wake up. That's Bob Lynn, the elusive butterfly, number six on the Wisdom Sound of Music Survey. What spot is this? Pretty high. What do you have? Blue Ribbon, of course. Yeah, well, I, uh, I've got about 23 minutes before I can join you, fellas, and between now and six, news, of course. From WISM, of course. This golden ring is a thing right there, and the fortunes are... I, I think a mighty fine group, you know, instrumentally and vocally and all the way around. Yeah, a little touch of polish there. 20 minutes and uh, that's at 20 before 6 o'clock. Uh, two six on the wisdomometer, right to do. Uh, right to... Would you believe a pizza pie for the weekend? Does that sound great or what? Pizza-wise, lager-wise, and family-wise, there's no place like Shakey's. If you really want to succeed, yeah. always bear this in mind. What's that? Do one to others. Yeah. And then... Cut out. <laughs> we gotta wait. We gotta wait till six o'clock. King Richard will take over then. Same place, right here. Time. T I M E. That's all it's called, and uh, it's a mighty peaceful sound right there. And if you're alone, uh, maybe you've done this sort of 
hum along, a little harmony and so on, right? Okay. I know the feeling. Uh, do you have a question or what? Why is it that you'll find a fantastic sale of exquisite ski wear at Russell Marina now during their boating and capping show? Your sweet. The January show, 14 minutes to go before 6 and uh, the countdown between now and then. News, of course. What else? Yep. Say, uh, somebody has recorded, we have a new hot prospect, uh, another old Hank Williams song brought back. I, I confess, I have not heard Did it this you one. hear that yet. lonesome river? His name is B.J. Thomas in the Triumphs. Nice hot prospect. Ah, oh, yeah. The market cried, the old Hank Williams song. It's the big West Coast sound of DJs. And that's where I'll be tonight, broadcasting live from 8 until 11. DJs features entertainment, California style, a selection of 10,000 oldies but goodies, and current chart busters. Right. And stay tuned to the King Richard Show for announcements of somebody that has a couple of birds and New Colony 6 tickets and can't come down because they found out that I was going to be there with J.O. Day to MC the second show. Oh, <laughs> you boy. Rambler made news at Nicola. Rambler made news at Nicola. Rambler American. Rambler American wins acceleration test class six pure oil performance trials. Joe January, thanking you very sincerely for whatever you've been doing, including driving carefully. And uh, we we'll see you in the mornings between 9 and 12 noon and the afternoons between 4 and 6 over there. Boy, this is a fast time. We'll have a beer and grab some news, all right? J.J. Fade away. And on the wisdomometer, it's now 25, 25 degrees in Madison. The wisdom weather summary, blowing snow. The weather is brought to you as a service of Comstock, the men who know tires best, and by the National Guardian Life Insurance Company on WISM, AM, and FM. Madison. 6 p.m. 666. Now, WISM. You want to say something? Is you describing the show as a six, 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 six? Yeah, six, six. Oh, six. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Later. Okay, there, friends and neighbors. We open up these family type shows around here. <laughs> woman, Peter and Garden. You, woman, me, man. Woman. <laughs> That's <laughs> Joe. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. What are you gonna do with January? I don't know. Yeah, that's an idea. Okay, you're going to calm down right now. You selected him out there, and uh, you had a special treat if you called the phone. You didn't get Colleen today. No, you got uh, Big Nick Nichols handled all the uh, requests, and uh, let's see what he came up with, huh? Wisdom Radio, we love Madison. Everybody goose. American TV, Wisconsin's largest TV and appliance dealer, goose. America. Do we die for number 20 in the King's Countdown Show? Here's the other half of it. It's the Shangri-Las. Long, long live our love. <laughs> Hey, I'll go with that. Long, long live our love. The Shangri-Las, a two-way tie for number 20, selected by you there on the King's Countdown Show. He taps you on the shoulder. This is Officer Bert Hoffman from the Madison Police Department Traffic Bureau. Traffic laws will protect you. If you respect them. No cheating either, Bert, baby. I'm right with you. Here you go. Number 19 in the King's Countdown Show, The Cheater. Yeah, they call it The Cheater there. Big number 19 here in the King's Countdown Show, selected by you on Wisdom Radio. We've got 13 and a half minutes uh, after 6 o'clock. No cheating on that. You can bet you're the bottom dollar. And here we go at the King's Countdown Show. Two-way tie for number 19, along with uh, the Cheater, it's the Volts in Magic Town. This Magic Town. 
Magic Town by the Vogues right there. Came in a two-way tie for number 19. You selected it out there on the King's Countdown. Find out during YNTP Daytona at Shakey Pontiac. No reasonable offer refused. Here we go. Big number 18 on the King's Countdown show. The new Colony 6. Do it for you on Wisdom Radio. Came in number 18 here in the King's Countdown show this evening. The new Colony 6 swinging out your way and it's called I Confess. Yeah, baby, these boots are made for walking. That's Nancy Sinatra. Pick them up, lay them down right there. Number 17 in the Kings. I That's the Marmalade. And uh, don't mess around old William. Let me tell you. 27 minutes here before 7 o'clock in the King Richard Countdown Show from Wisdom Radio. up in the morning and discover your car is being devoured by rust. The right fender just fell off and the left fender's in jeopardy. Your car has a look of pain on its face as rust devours its underside. Well, take heart, take your car to Struck and Irwin and have it rushed through. You. Bobby Fuller, four, I fought the law on the law one. Two, eight, high for number 15 in the King's Countdown. Want to get with the in sound and drum? Stop it and see Swing and Ray Kettner and Ward brought music. Your drum headquarters in Madison. Hi, Stoney Wallace here for American TV's West Beltline location. Hey, if you want to sound like that from your guitar, you'll need a first-rate app. Join the in crowd. Go American TV, 3303 West Beltline Highway. On a King's Countdown Friday style, this is the Dave Clark Five. Came in number five tonight. It's called Have to See. Okay, about 25 and a half to go before 8 o'clock. We got a score here. Monona Grove leads Central 31 23 at halftime. 26 degrees outside. We go to the number four song right after we snap the crown off a bottle of blood. Number four, wanted a banana. In a little quiet town, just south of the Mexican border, there lived a lovely Juanita, a banana grower's daughter. She longed to sing at the opera, but her father laughed and made fun. Still, Juanita would sing each day in the fields, as soon as her work was done. All right, Bowser. Bowser's just jealous because he can't get up that high. <laughs> That's Juanita Banaba. That is a wild thing. All right, all right, all right, all right. Listen, you're getting Bowser all worked up. Right? All right, already. Baby, hey, hey. That's better. That's that's much better for crying out loud. The Water Brothers, the most talented group currently appearing in the Midwest, are appearing upstairs at the Gun Club this Sunday night. Guys and gals, make your plans right now to see and hear the fabulous Water Brothers. Sunday night at the Gun Club. Shoot straight to the Gun Club, nine miles east of Madison on Cottage Grove Road. The Gun Club, your headquarters for the finest weekend entertainment. Be at the Gun Club Sunday night for the fabulous Warner Brothers. Yeah, live entertainment at the Gun Club tonight by Tim Davis of the Cortez. Admission, just a dollar. Hey, no, no. All right, you asked for it. <laughs> Slow down. Slow down and live. So much for wanting a banana. This is Don Stewart of the Madison Police Department Traffic Bureau. The place to stop drunken driving is at the bend of the elbow, not at the bend of the road. Twenty minutes after twelve on a Sunday morning, John Little get together. We'd like to uh, report a few basketball scores. In fact, what I'll try to do is uh, quickly read sixty-eight Bear Creek thirty-three. 11 minutes in front of one on the John Little Sunday night get-together. Sunday morning get-together is what it is. <laughs> oh, 
Okay, let's peel this banana, shall we?